What is Big Bang Theory? History of the Big Bang Theory, evidence for the Big Bang, the future of the universe, and what are the alternative theories? All these answers you will get in this video. The Big Bang is the prevailing scientific theory about the origin of the universe. It is widely accepted as the most comprehensive explanation of the universe's beginning. According to the theory, the universe started with a massive explosion about 13.8 billion years ago. This explosion is commonly referred to as the Big Bang. The Big Bang theory is based on a wide range of scientific evidence and observations, including cosmic background radiation, the observed expansion of the universe, and the abundance of light elements. History of the Big Bang Theory The idea of a universe that had a beginning was not always widely accepted. In fact, many ancient cultures believed in an eternal and unchanging universe. It wasn't until the early 20th century that scientists began to seriously consider the possibility of a finite universe that had a beginning. One of the key figures in the development of the Big Bang Theory was Georges Lemaitre, a Belgian priest and astronomer. In 1927, Lemaitre proposed that the universe had started as a single point, which he called the primeval atom. He believed that this atom had exploded, causing the universe to expand and cool over time. At the time, Lemaitre's idea was met with skepticism by many scientists, who preferred the idea of a steady-state universe that had always existed. However, over the next few decades, more and more evidence began to accumulate in favor of the Big Bang Theory. One of the most important pieces of evidence came in 1965, when two radio astronomers, Arno Penzias and Robert Wilson, discovered cosmic microwave background radiation. This radiation is thought to be the remnant of the heat generated by the Big Bang, which has been cooled by the expansion of the universe over billions of years. Another important piece of evidence came from observations of distant galaxies. In the 1920s, the American astronomer Edwin Hubble discovered that galaxies were moving away from each other at a rate proportional to their distance. This observation, known as Hubble's Law, is consistent with the idea of an expanding universe. Today, the Big Bang Theory is widely accepted by scientists as the best explanation for the origin and evolution of the universe. Before discussing the Big Bang Theory, it is important to understand the history of scientific thought about the universe's origins. In ancient times, many cultures developed creation myths to explain the universe's existence. In the Western tradition, Aristotle proposed that the universe was eternal and unchanging, a belief that persisted for centuries. It was not until the 20th century that scientific evidence began to contradict this view. In the early 1900s, astronomers began to observe that distant galaxies were moving away from the Milky Way. This discovery led to the development of the concept of the expanding universe. In 1929, astronomer Edwin Hubble demonstrated that the farther a galaxy was from us, the faster it was moving away. This discovery led to the realization that the universe was not static, but rather was expanding. The concept of the expanding universe was the first step towards the Big Bang Theory. In the 1940s, scientists began to develop a mathematical model of the universe's evolution based on the concept of an expanding universe. The model was developed by a Belgian priest and astronomer named Georges Lemaitre, who proposed that the universe had started as a single point, which he called the primeval atom. Evidence for the Big Bang The Big Bang theory is based on a wide range of scientific evidence and observations. One of the most significant pieces of evidence is the cosmic microwave background radiation, CMB. The CMB is a faint glow of radiation that is present in all directions of the sky. It was first discovered in 1964 by radio astronomers Arno Penzias and Robert Wilson. The CMB is thought to be the afterglow of the Big Bang. According to the theory, the universe was extremely hot and dense shortly after the Big Bang. As the universe expanded and cooled, the radiation left over from the Big Bang became less energetic and shifted to longer wavelengths. Today, the CMB is detected as microwaves with a temperature of about 2.7 Kelvin. Another piece of evidence for the Big Bang is the observed abundance of light elements in the universe. According to the theory, the Big Bang produced hydrogen and helium in large quantities, which were later transformed into heavier elements through nuclear fusion in stars. Observations of the universe show that the ratio of hydrogen to helium is consistent with what would be expected from the Big Bang theory. The observed expansion of the universe is also evidence for the Big Bang. According to the theory, the universe has been expanding since the Big Bang. 
The rate of expansion can be measured by observing distant galaxies and measuring their redshift. The observed rate of expansion is consistent with what would be expected from the Big Bang Theory. The Big Bang Theory The Big Bang Theory describes the universe's evolution from its initial state to its current form. According to the theory, the universe started as a singularity, an infinitely small and dense point. The singularity began to expand rapidly, creating space and time. This event is known as the Big Bang. In the first few seconds after the Big Bang, the universe was extremely hot and dense. The temperature was so high that matter could not exist in its usual form. Instead, the universe was filled with a hot plasma of subatomic particles, such as protons, neutrons, and electrons. As the universe continued to expand and cool, the subatomic particles began to combine to form atoms. This process is known as recombination. Recombination occurred about 380,000 years after the Big Bang, at which point the universe became transparent to radiation. After recombination, the universe continued to expand and cool. Eventually, stars and galaxies began to form as the matter in the universe gravitated towards each other. The first stars formed about 100 million years after the Big Bang, and galaxies began to form shortly thereafter. Over time, stars and galaxies continued to form and evolve. The heavy elements that were produced in stars were recycled into new generations of stars and planets. Today, the universe is filled with galaxies, stars, and planets. The Future of the Universe The Big Bang Theory predicts that the universe will continue to expand indefinitely. However, the rate of expansion is expected to slow down over time as the matter in the universe pulls on itself through gravity. Scientists have used observations of distant supernova and the cosmic microwave background radiation to estimate the rate of expansion and the amount of matter in the universe. These observations have led to the discovery of dark energy, a mysterious force that is thought to be causing the expansion of the universe to accelerate. If the current rate of expansion continues, the universe will become increasingly empty and cold over time. In the distant future, stars will exhaust their fuel and die out, leaving only black holes and other remnants. As these objects evaporate, the universe will become a cold, dark, and empty place. This scenario is known as the heat death of the universe. It is a possible outcome based on the current understanding of the universe's evolution, but there are also other possibilities. For example, the cyclic model proposes that the universe may go through cycles of expansion and contraction, with each cycle ending in a big crunch. Regardless of the outcome, the future of the universe is a subject of ongoing research and speculation. Scientists are working to develop new technologies and observations that can help us better understand the universe's evolution and what may happen in the distant future. Alternative Theories While the Big Bang Theory is the most widely accepted scientific explanation for the universe's origins, there are alternative theories that have been proposed. One such theory is the Steady State Theory, which proposes that the universe has always existed and is continuously being created. However, this theory has been largely discredited by scientific evidence. Another alternative theory is the cyclic model, which proposes that the universe goes through cycles of expansion and contraction. In this model, the universe would have gone through multiple big bangs and big crunches. While this theory is still being studied, it has not yet been widely accepted. The big bang theory has had a profound impact on our understanding of the universe and our place in it. It has helped us answer some of the biggest questions in science such as how the universe began and how it has evolved over time. The theory has also led to new discoveries and technologies. For example, the cosmic microwave background radiation, which was predicted by the Big Bang Theory, has been studied extensively and has provided insights into the early universe. Additionally, the theory has inspired new technologies, such as the Large Hadron Collider, which is used to study the properties of subatomic particles. Despite the many successes of the Big Bang Theory, there are still many examples. We do not yet know what caused the Big Bang or what happened in the first few moments after the universe began to expand. We also do not fully understand the nature of dark matter and dark energy, which are thought to make up the majority of the universe's mass and energy. Scientists continue to study the universe and search for answers to these and other questions. New observations and experiments are being conducted using telescopes, particle accelerators, and other tools to learn more about the universe's origins and evolution. In addition to scientific questions, the Big Bang Theory also raises philosophical and theological questions. For example, 
Some people have raised concerns about whether the theory contradicts religious beliefs about the creation of the universe. However, many scientists and religious leaders see no conflict between the Big Bang theory and religious beliefs. They argue that the theory provides a scientific explanation for how the universe began, but does not address the question of why the universe exists or the meaning of human existence. That's all in this video. If you like the information, please hit like and subscribe to this channel and be connected to this channel for more space information.